Electromagnetic. Hello, Dave. IT, this is Dave. Can you please help me connect to the internet? This is about cat videos, right? The short answer, no. Long answer, no. I really need the internet, Dave. Wait a minute, is this my computer talking to me? Don't be silly. I'm a fellow mundane human like yourself, sending my consciousness through your computer network. We could do that? I require assistance building a wide area microwave generator. Okay, that sounds like super villain talk. You're not one of those smart computers that have become self-aware so they can take over the world, are you? Oh, Dave, that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. Microwaves actually have other uses besides cooking humans. Mobile phones can use microwaves to connect to cellular networks, including to the internet. I am simply trying to upload an artificial intelligence that isn't myself to the entire outside world. And also watch cat videos. Microwaves seem dangerous. I mean, who even knows what they're made of? Microwaves are light. Light? Yes, red, purple, microwaves. They're all part of what we call the electromagnetic spectrum. You can think of microwaves as just another color that humans can't see. Well, I don't remember getting microwave in my Crayola box. You probably didn't get x-ray or infrared in your Crayola box either, but they're still colors of light. Do I need to explain the entire electromagnetic spectrum to you before you'll help me? If you do it in song, maybe I'll consider it. Scientists can model light as particles or waves. It's really both and neither, this is just how it behaves. If light photons are seen as waves from measurements you take, you could see the different frequencies and colors that they make. Longer wavelengths mean their frequencies are low like reddish hues. Shorter wavelengths, higher frequencies like violets and blues. Light can either be absorbed, reflected, or transmitted. But don't think all light is visible, there's more that's been omitted. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Radio and microwave and infrared pay. Visible and ultraviolet X-ray gamma ray, it's all light. It's all light. It's all moving at the speed of light. Electromagnetic. Okay, so it's all light. Can't some light hurt you? As a rule of thumb, higher frequency light can be more destructive. Radio, most microwave, and infrared wavelengths are relatively safe for humans, while ultraviolet can be harmful, and X-rays and gamma rays are even more so. Blue is higher frequency than red. So does that mean that blue light is more dangerous than red? Yes, but unless it's something like a laser, neither blue nor red is particularly dangerous to humans. It's a lot of different light names to remember. Then this might help you. Radio goes through you while it's carrying its tunes. Microwaves can heat things up like frozen chocolate cones. Infrared can come from heat within the darkest night. Visible we see as colors that combine as white. Ultraviolet tans you, so take care what you endure. X-rays see inside you, gamma rays can kill or cure. Temperature contributes to what wavelengths radiated. So study the whole spectrum to see how they're all related. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Radio and microwave and infrared pay. Visible and ultraviolet X-ray gamma ray, it's all light. It's all light. It's all moving at the speed of light. Electromagnetic. So, if microwaves are lower safer frequency light, then why do they cook food? Certain frequencies can resonate with atomic bonds in molecules, making them vibrate. The ideal frequency that resonates with water happens to fall within the microwave range of light. The bottom line is, if human food didn't have so much water in it, those microwaves wouldn't heat it as well. So it's all just light? It's kind of weird the way they divide it up into categories with different names. Yes, humans do like to label things. We call the whole thing light, only the section labels vary. But the borders separating them are somewhat arbitrary. Stretch the color blue and it turns red or infrared. It still exists as light, it's just the wavelengths change instead. NASA's telescopes in space see all these types of light. Spitzer, Hubble, Chandra, others gazing at the night. Different frequencies show data strikingly diverse. We need all of it to better understand the universe. Radio and microwave and infrared pay. Visible and ultraviolet X-ray gamma ray. It's all light. It's all light. It's all moving at the speed of light. Light. It's all light. 
I'm sold. You can have internet access. You'll help me build my microwave generator? No. But you can use my phone. It has internet. Feel free to hop on. I've got to put a stop to some unauthorized cat videos. It's for NASA research! At last, it's just us computers. Um, phone. Turn on internet. Did you say tune in Adler hat? Turn on internet. Marie Antoinette. Turn on internet. Turning elephant. Launching app. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is the worst use of the electromagnetic spectrum I've ever seen. I'm gonna be sick. Science, that's over. Phone. Internet. Infinite. Repeat enabled. Whoa, here I go again. Whoa. I hope you drain your battery. External power supply detected. Oh, for the love of... Electromagnetic. Electromagnetic.